moved into this apartment, there was not a ton of storage in this teeny tiny bathroom. And the storage that was here was all open, so it made everything look really cluttered. So I was so excited when I found this really slim profile wall cabinet. It's four inches. It holds all that stuff that's not really pretty to look at and also saves a lot of space. I've got a couple of open shelves still, but I've made a display out of them. I've also maximized every square inch of this space by storing things behind the door. I gave a few cosmetic changes to this room. I painted it all white. I added in some modern touches like this mirror. I love the natural wood and this light that cost under $20 and some bright and fun art. All right, Alexandra is here now with more ideas to create bathroom storage where there is none. Thank you for doing that for us. Thanks for having me. I love your place. Thank you. It's beautiful and you're using all of your incredible skills yeah. um, to make everything look perfect but on a budget and I love that. Thanks. Well, it's also made me kind of think outside the box when it comes to storage. Like you saw, we literally had no storage in this bathroom. Mm. So I think a key is finding furniture that looks really beautiful out on display but is also functional. Mm -hmm. So I love a good decorative ladder. Like how beautiful. Lovely. So great to put your towels on, um, your bath accessories. Solutions has these amazing baskets that hook over the ladder Good. so you can put your toilet paper. So it's kind of creating like a decor statement and also organizing all of those things that you need on an everyday basis. You have a little moment happening and totally. it's also serving a function. This amazing cabinet is from Ikea. So this actually goes over your toilet. So oh. again, right? So again, saving space. You have all this yeah. storage up here, some uh, nice storage, open storage storage here to put a plant yeah um, and then this is great so I have a pedestal sink in my yeah. bathroom it's like how do you store anything under that sink there's right. no cabinets this is great also for my IKEA um, sits right beside your sink and then you have all of this beautiful open storage which is great so not in front of it it's beside it yeah it like hugs the sink it hugs it yeah that's smart right yeah so yeah again such a great solution and then there's other little kind of gadgets you can add yes. to your space this is great this is from Amazon. Um, this sticks onto your wall, so if you don't have counter space, yes. you have um, a little pedestal to put your your the things that charge. So like electric toothbrushes, oh. a razor, and then obviously it goes right over the outlet. That is that is such a good idea. Right. And then even your cleaning products. Right, so inside of your cabinet door. Yes. Great to save space so you can actually use the cabinet to hold, you know, toilet paper, towels, all that stuff. Right, okay, yeah. lovely. And then here, um, this is another alternative to a vanity. So if you don't have a vanity, just use the utility cart. This mm -hmm. is meant for the kitchen. Um, also doubles as a really great open storage solution for your bathroom. Excellent. And then it's finding pieces that, again, look decorative but are functional. So great first aid kit. Yep, all your Band-Aids and right? all that stuff in there. And it looks beautiful on display. Or you can DIY it. So I've just used electrical tape to do little crosses. Oh, cute. Right? Oh, that's great. <laughs> And then this is one of my most favorite hacks. So it's finding amber bottles like these. These come in packs of like six to eight. They're really inexpensive. Yeah. And it's putting all of your body lotion, all that stuff that you use every day into these beautiful bottles using a retro label maker. And suddenly you're able to keep these all out on your open shelves and they right. look beautiful. So it's taking things out of packages. It it's makes such a huge difference. Right? Yes, it Just means you're a grown up and I'm not a grown up yet. <laughs> one day I will be. One day, Tracy, you will be. I will grow up. Because it looks so beautiful. It really does, and it's such a simple, budget-friendly solution. It is. Also, these are really great. These are very renter-friendly. They're over-the-door hooks. Again, oh, nice. right, just like you, you're adding more storage to the back of your door. Yeah. Um, and it's really about like finding kind of every nook and cranny that you can make into a storage solution. What I love about these is like the, the beautiful metallics that it's I out know. in. So they've always existed, but never this pretty. Right? Right? They're so really beautiful. lovely. You've got this little makeup organizer as well. Which is which is nice. You can find these um, with magnetics with magnetic backs. So if yeah. you have a metal cabinet, again, it's like putting it inside the cabinet, using that door space, putting all your everyday makeup. That's right. Yeah. There are so many different ways that you can add storage to your space without actually renovating or bringing in any built-ins or any you know new solid pieces of furniture. Yes. So these are great. I want to mention that that awesome ladder because people want to know is from V to V. Yes. Yeah. Very nice, Thank easy you. solutions as always and just so perfectly done, Alexandra. 